What is voltage? Let's say you have a system consisting of two tanks connected by a tube. The upper of the two tanks we'll call the negative tank. This tank has a valve that controls water flow from the tank. In the center of the tube, there is a water wheel which we'll use to demonstrate work being performed later on. And finally, at the bottom of the tube is another tank called the positive tank. By now, I'm sure you're wondering what all of this water business has to do with voltage. Well, the water molecules in tank 1 has a higher potential to do work than those in tank 2, even when there is no water flowing between the tanks and thus no work being performed. It is this potential difference that can be utilized to do some work, so let's open that valve. Immediately, you can see the water molecules start flowing down between the tanks and in the process, turning the water wheel. By allowing this flow of water, one is actually reducing the potential difference between the tanks by converting the potential difference in energy into real work being done by turning the wheel. If you have a battery specified at 1.5 volts, it means that there is a potential of 1.5 volts between the positive and negative terminals of the battery. If you connect the battery to a circuit that allows for the flow of electrons from the negative to the positive terminal, much like the water molecules between the tanks, you are also slowly lowering the potential difference or the voltage of the battery.